Hello and welcome back to Flynn's Arcade. Here we are again. Sainsbury's have re-released their cards. They're now Create the World Incredible Inventions. They fetched them back for the second year, along with a brand new book, Incredible Inventions, which obviously we're going to start collecting stuff for them. But first of all, seeing as you all watched it last year and you saw the cards, we thought we'd come back and open some more cards for you. So we've got the dark blue ones, which we got free with the book. And then we've got these ones, which are the booster packs. They're 50p each, as you can see there. Or if you spend £10 at Sainsbury's, you get a packet with them. But the booster packs are probably the best way to go, because they're cheaper at 50 pence each. So right, let's get round to opening them. All right, first of all, we'll open one of the uh, free packets. Again, like last year, I snipped the tops off them all, just to make it easier. Now I did think that Sainsbury's had just repackaged the cards so they were going to be the same as last year's because last year we got two full sets but I did open a packet off camera just to make sure and they are all different cards so let's get started and let's have a look so we've got Caveman what's that one? Genie Girl, that's a new one a detective and then you always get that one which is a shiny one which is a mobile phone now these are all new minifigures because there has been a few minifigure series since it came out for example cake guy which is another new one uh the diver and all that kind of stuff so thank you sainsbury's for having all new cards so hitchhiker cycle oh there's an extra one in this one Two creator cards, that's quite good. Because I know there were a complaint last year that Sainsbury's sometimes didn't package them properly. Oh, we've got another diver. And that a lot of the packs had less cards than they should have. There should have been four cards per pack. So a lot of the cards last year were only like three per pack, which were really annoying people. And it, it, it did get on a lot of people's nerves and they had to complain about them. So... Sainsbury's has assured this time that they have managed to get the supplier correct and that the cards are actually correct. So up to now I've got four in each pack as you can see. I'm going through them all. And we seem to be getting four in each pack. We've even got five in one pack. So fingers crossed we shall get them all. That one's cool. Minotaur. I wish that were a minifigure. I like that one. Butterfly girl, oh, another doggy. Now, I've, uh, last year we got two full sets by swapping with people. So I'm hoping this year we can do the same thing. That's cool, I might have to make that look properly. And see if we can get another couple of sets. One for the book and one, well, the other set we've got. We've got one in the book, got a lot of the divers. And we framed one of them. So we've got another set framed, which I'll show you in a separate video. Because uh, it's upstairs at the moment. Now, I'm sure he was in the last one. No, he can't have been, because he's in one of the recent series, The Wrestler. Sorry, I went off on one there. Uh, so yes, we'll look at that in a different video. So I'm hoping to get another two sets. One for the book, and one. That's cool. And one, so we can frame it again. Cactus Guy, that's a new one. Girl, Cactus Girl. Uh, so yes, one for the book, one for the frame. So if there's anybody watching this video and they've got any swaps, send me a message. <laughs> we'll see what we can do. We can uh, exchange, we can swap, we can do what we need to do to uh, get everybody a full set. As you can see, I'm just rifling through them. You can see them quickly. It's quite a lot of packets we've got. We always like to start off with quite a few. Now that one is definitely from last year. That's a cool car. Just a few more left. Like I said, we'll just rifle through them. So yeah, what do you think about Sainsbury's bringing these cards out again? Do you think it's a money-grabbing scheme? Do you think you collect them? I really like them. I enjoy them. My son enjoys them. We, we collect them together. We like swapping. We like looking for the new ones. We don't shop at Sainsbury's because we haven't got any Sainsbury's near us. So... The free ones with the £10 isn't really an option for us. So the only Sainsbury's I go through, I go past, sorry, is a little one where I work and they have them. So we just buy them at the 50 pence. 
that one's cool so every time we go past or every time I go past with work if I go past it I uh, just pop in and get a few well last time I did anyway this time we started off with quite a few just to make sure we've got some another cactus and we thought we'd uh, do another video on them my son's not with me today he's gone out for the day so I thought I'd just do this while he's not here but he's fine with it he said it was fine and he'll be collecting more in the future so yeah back to the question what do you think of these cars do you like them do you not like them comment below let me know what you think like I say I think they're, they're really good we really enjoy collecting them some people really dislike them I've no idea why everybody to their own really that one's cool uh, oh look, two of them. And uh, like I said, we enjoy collecting them. I'm not a, a big collector of stickers and stuff like that, but I think these are really cool because as a kid, I used to collect cards. I remember Garbage Pail Kids, if everybody remembers them. Show me age now, aren't I? But yeah, I used to collect lots and lots of them. I wish I kept them now. They're probably worth some money. Last packet. But yeah, I really enjoy collecting these. If you do, comment below. Let me know what you think of them. So last packet, we got Statue of Liberty. We got the Pretzel Girl. That one's cool. The put number 140 with a shiny background. That's really, really good. Quite impressed with that one. And the pencil. We can make the pencil in real life. So there you go. That's an absolute shed load of cards opened. So what we're going to do, off camera, me and my son are going to put them in the book. I hope you enjoyed it looking at these cards again so thank you for watching Flynn's Arcade please like subscribe and share I have now got a patreon page if you want to subscribe to the patreon page pop over there the links in the description below there's no obligation it's entirely up to yourself but if you do I will be very very grateful and I am very grateful for your continued support and watching my videos so thanks for watching please like subscribe and share like I said see you next time bye bye